Hey guys, it's it's Five Elias here, and I'm going to be showing you today how to get um, the Control Delete Login in Windows XP. Now, the first thing you want to do is uh, go right to the Start menu, and then click on Run, and type in uh, Control Control User User Password. And then just click right here, change the way users log on or log off, and then just deselect that checkbox, click on apply options. And then you're going to go right to the start menu and click on run again, and then type in uh, control user passwords 2, control user passwords 2, and then this is what you should get, and then click on the advanced tab, and just click right there, and then click on apply. Click on this box right here, and then click on apply, and click on OK. And then after that, just log off to test it and it does work. Serious? And then there you go, you have the control delete login for Windows XP. And this works for all versions. And as you can see here, I have MCE or Media Center Edition. And uh, after that, this is what you should get. Um, it's just a Microsoft Windows XP and the version you have and the copyright 1985 to whatever year Microsoft Corporation. And this is right here in the help button. Click right there for help. And then it just said this here, uh, requiring this key combination at startup helps, helps keep your computer secure. For more information, click help. So after that, you're good to go. So it's pretty simple. And this also helps you um, access the hidden administrator account. And this also helps you um, access the hidden administrator account. But you can also add... So you're good to go after that. Thanks for watching.